Hello everyone, I'm Gerardo Gamber, and welcome back to Seven Days to Die. It is nighttime, and we've got a deer running around the front yard. <laughs> Not really a yard, but a place. A place in front of our place. Uh, so we're going to clear out some zombies here. We were trying to clear them out. And uh, I'm hearing sounds out there. Oh, we're smashing into a wall. Get off my wall, please. Thank you. Oh, ugh, oh, he got a hit on us. That wasn't nice. I don't much like the zombies hanging around here because there's explosives and uh, it makes me nervous. I don't want my base to go down. Hey, they took down a tree. Let's go check on that, shall we? Where is it? Here we are. Lumberjack zombie, hard at work. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme. Thank you. <laughs> I'm Robin Williams. No, I'm not. Uh, so, we've got quite a few zombies just roaming around here. and Base survival. Wow. Get stuck on the bush. Um, base survival is day by day. Ooh, he spawned out of nowhere. I think he did, at least. Um... I would very much like to take your stuff if you have anything. Yeah, yeah, kill it. There we go. Okay, so we're going to put some stuff away. It is getting morning, uh, and I'm going to... Whoops, not go that direction, because that's freaking stupid. We're going to go over to the military base and collect some stuff. Hey, bunny! Hey! You want to get inside? Come on, bunny. Fine, be that way. Either way, bunny. <laughs> I'll live alone. <laughs> uh, we're gonna go collect some stuff from military base, hopefully some guns and stuff we may have missed. Um, unless I can't really remember what I did, in fact, pick up while I was there. We're gonna move some of this useless stuff. There isn't a whole lot we can do at this stage, um, but I think it'd still be good practice to go out and collect some things. To be fair, I am literally waiting for the new update. I am, uh... I I've shown the majority of what I can show in this game for now, and getting a little creative with it uh, is a bit of a stretch. So, I I've got to go out and see if there's anything I can get out of this. I would like to get another sniper rifle, because we've lately not had much in the way of sniper rifle. Damn, they they did a lot of damage to this. Oh, boy. Thank you for uh, not being a jerk, zombies. Not. Um, so we're going to go military base and see what we can see, see what we can loot. And maybe from there... Depending on what we have, we might head down to the little cabin and uh, grab some loot from there. I had to craft myself a new crossbow. As you can see here, my previous crossbow was in dire straits. And in fact, leaving my base for a bit to get supplies is a really good idea because I realized I didn't have a lot of food. Um, I mean, I still got some deer meat and rabbit meat things like that, but ready supplies of food. You always want to carry some food on you and then have food stored away uh, more than you could possibly use, because you never know when you're going to get holed in by zombies, and that becomes a constant problem. We're going to eat a bit of these, and I'm stuck on a bush! Oh, not being able to jump on bushes is such a problem. Um, so let me check out this military base. Have we been up here? Looks like some shit's been blown up. Yeah, I think we were here with a rocket launcher, weren't we? Yeah. So we did loot. We did loot this place. How thorough were we? I can't remember. I really can't remember. It's been a while. I think I did die here <laughs> at some point. Um, mm, just gotta be careful. Oh, always worried about bunny rabbits and deers here. I hear you. Hey, how are you? Uh, 
was kind of hoping he'd land on something and just blow up. It'd be silly. Yeah, hornet. Can we eat the hornet? No, we cannot. I tried. I tried. Take all your chairs because we can. Give me your chairs. I'm going to take these. I can't believe I didn't grab these the first time I was here. Or second. Did we come here a second time? I can't remember. Hey, we found a sniper rifle. That's actually really good. That's exactly what I was hoping for. We have plenty of ammo for it, so no excuses. We can use it. Actually, I'm so confident I will actually put the pistol away. Screw you, pistol. We want our sniper rifle. Sniper rifle. Sniper rifle. Sounds like a really fun time, doesn't it? Uh, I would pick it up, but... Hey, we've got a bed. I'm going to put that down as an extra spawn point. As you can see, my spawn point is still glitched, which is just beautiful, really. Don't actually need that. Um, don't need that. We do need the medication, so we're going to take that. God, I'm going cross-eyed. Ugh. A little bit tired. Uh, I've been sleeping a lot. No, I'm still, still re recovering from the flu. Um, I no longer have a fever or anything. It's just I've been feeling like such garbage lately. You know, you, you go through a lot like that, and it takes you a while to recover. Let's see there, nothing. Punch you in the face. Yeah. Wasn't exactly your face, but I tried. Hey, we got a bit of canvas missing. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm gonna grab all this cloth. Oh, these cloth. We keep checking that for some reason. I don't know why. It's force of habit, I guess. Um, yeah, that's right. There was really nothing in there. Hey, I didn't see that before. Okay, so we didn't get any food. Uh, so we're gonna head down to this little cabin here and hopefully find something of value. Is that? Oh yeah, we checked him already. <laughs> Doesn't hurt to double check. Yep. It hurts to blow up, but not to double check. Put those mines away for now. Maybe we get to break in this gun too. Shoot some uh, walkers. Yeah. Wonder what it's gonna be like when they add animals into the game, like the zombie animals. That is, there already are animals in this game, but hey, we got all these other places we can go to. I wonder if this is a bit of a hint at the other maps that they're going to be making. I think that would be pretty cool if uh, they added these different cities in. Eh, you never know. I mean, they're here. Why the hell not? Are they going to leave that to the modding community? I'm not sure. I am still looking forward to them. Why did we pick up? Whatever. Whatever. Let's not question it. We'll do away with it later. Um, I'm still looking forward to the creation kit that they'll be adding to this game. And I think that would be amazing for people like... <sighs> don't need it. People like me who... Ooh. Uh, <laughs> who don't ooh, but... <laughs> uh, I think it'll be really cool for people like me who enjoy making maps. I, I, I would really like that. I would really like them to do something along those lines. We're going to uh, repair that pistol. There we go. Ah, we're stuck on the inventory screen. There we go. Um, but yeah, I, I would very much like to use it. Uh, they haven't released it yet. They said... Wow. We're getting quite lucky with that stuff. We don't really need the fire axe right now. We've got a fire axe at home. Um, when this game was first going to come out, they said they were going to release it alongside the game, but that never happened. Uh, the editor never came out, and I felt a little bit sad. That's not Billy, so we can get away with murder! Wow, one shot no more? Really? There we go. Wow, they nerfed the sniper rifle. I don't know why. That's a little sad. Whatever, that's a thing. Damn it! Just beat your maker. Oh, I love the animation though. There we go. 
Oh, if Billy's watching, forgive me. I think I just wasted bullets. Whoops. <laughs> That's too easy. That's too easy. We're not going to kill a bunny. Oh, Billy, I hope you weren't watching. I just murdered a bunch of your family members. Um, but yeah, we're doing pretty well on stuff right now. Oh, there's the cabin. Wow. Getting distracted. and We don't need that. We don't need those. We're not using them. Uh, blah, 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 blah. So we're going to loot this place and we have to kill some walkers first. Wow, epic miss. And they all walk indoors. Church is over. Inside. <laughs> God, I haven't used this in forever, and my aim is just shit. It does seem like they've nerfed it. It doesn't feel the same. I like the animations, though. Those are really sweet. Yeah. Moments like this, I wish I had a rocket launcher. You're not very bright, are you, zombies? Whoa. Snapper effer. Yeah. Just die. Sploosh. Skabaloon. You're done. Let's see what we can find in here. Besides their... <laughs> Look at this! That's just getting borderline silly now, like... Every zombie that crawls on the ground has massive wedgie issues. <laughs> what is he doing? Okay, not just the zombies on the ground. Mm, we don't really need that, but we'll do something with that. Look at this. Is he face planting his ass? Yes, he is, because his legs are right here and his ass is right there. What are you doing? What are you doing? Yep. Okay. I will leave you to it. And this guy's doing the exact same thing. <laughs> He's got his head shoved so far up his buttocks. <laughs> there's no there's no hope for this one. There's none. Um, let's grab this. Mm, delicious dog food made out of cats. Mm -mm -mm, good. Spam made out of dogs. Can of pasta. We came here for food, so let's drop that favor of that. Oh. Um. Yeah. Yeah, food is what we need. Food is definitely what we need. Okay, so we've pretty much looked through everything. We've got water. We'd like to get more water. And we have some empty bottles that we can Jars, sorry, we can fill up. Um, I don't need any of that. Why even look at it? Oh, delicious. Um, please. How can I? So let's try to stack that. Nope, you can't stack that because we're bad. How can I do this? 55 sticks. I would hate to leave sticks, but oh, it's such a hassle to figure out what I can drop. It really is, like, I've got a lot of stuff that I want to keep. I heard something behind me. Alright. Um, so we're going to turn that into wood. No, we're going to drop the 55 sticks. I guess we can always make more, as we just did, as a matter of fact. Oh! Oh, 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 delicious. Oh, more deliciousness. Ah! No! Stop! Stop it! Cornmeal. We can't turn that into corn seeds, so I'm not gonna bother. Um... Shotgun ammo. To be fair, I'm not even, like, using the shotgun lately. It used to be my go-to weapon, but I haven't been using that. They haven't fixed this yet. Whoops. Okay. <laughs> that was bad. 
Got a zombies knocking on heaven's door down there. This is bad singing ever. Like the worst singing you've ever heard. Let's minus a zombie. That's just silly and wrong. Um, running out of arrows, I noticed. Oh, great. Beautiful. He's just gonna wait for us. He's so polite. Let's shoot him in the crotch. Yeah! Uh-oh, he didn't like that. Okay. Give me your bullets. Um, hey there. Mr. Ignoring Us. That's what you get for ignoring us. Let's whack this grass. Give me the grass! Give me the grass! Here we go. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, figures, right? Get a stick that we do not need. I'm going... I don't have any stone. Can't make more arrows. I would like to make more arrows. Maybe I can drop some wood for this. Turn this into a rock. Turn that into a crossbow bolt. There we go. Um... That's only 32 planks of wood. Ah! Okay. I don't think we need the 32 planks of wood. Uh, it's dark. It's dark. It's dark. We should really head back home. We've got a lot of food and all sorts of good stuff. Yeah. Let's get the hell out of here. Uh, home is not down, it's up. Hello, fatty. What you up to? Ah, we're gonna miss you and kill a tree. That sounds like a great, great trade-off. Yeah. We're gonna fill up some water bottles here while we're here. Might as well. Okay, now we can head onwards and upwards. So night has fallen. And we have spent the day rummaging around in the forest and the cabin. And there are a lot of wasps just flying around. I wonder if there's a nest up here. Haven't seen it. It's kind of dark, so it's really hard to see, but... I can hear them. Look at that beautiful moon. Woo! It's big and round and glowy and all sorts of stuff. These damn bushes are the bane of my existence. I love it up here, but I don't like... Hello, bunny. Oh, where'd you go? He's off to great adventures. I love it up here. I just don't like getting stuck on everything. It's a hassle. But like I said before, a couple videos back, that's kind of the point. You're going to be in different biomes for different reasons, and each is going to have its own feeling. That's a dog. I hear a dog. <laughs> oh, oh god, he's closer than I thought. Smile, you son of a bitch. Yeah. Good dog. Hey, it was a really high iron dog. <laughs> he had a lot of protein and iron and all sorts of amazing stuff in his system. We've got an army of the dead marching on us here, and a wasp is trying to eat me. Which is just fantastic. Right out of the sky. This honey was worth it. Uh, we should eat something. Get a drink of water. We're in no real danger. As long as we keep killing wasps and killing those dogs. Uh, almost home. Almost made it home. I'm hearing that. What's going on? They're getting closer. Yeah, you won't see me doing this when I revert the game back to normal in Alpha 7. Um, as I don't, you know, I will not stand a chance out in the darkness against zombies that can run. 
you literally don't stand a chance. They run faster than you can even run, so... We've gotten away with it a few times in the past. We've gotten really lucky. Very shiny car. Very shiny car. You can just <laughs> lick it all up. Mm, you sick person. I hope you're hope hope you're really happy with yourself just <laughs> licking that car. Um, <laughs> but yeah, it uh, it's very dangerous at nighttime. If you have not played Seven Days to Die, you don't want to be outdoors at night during the normal normal game like this is just a modified version of the game where zombies will not run because I was frankly sick of it <laughs> alpha 7 that's going to change I'm going to revert them back to running zombies um, and maybe at some point I will do a complete rage fest um, episode where all the time they run like, like I'm not going to live very long doing that guarantee it there will be so much swearing so much anger so much dog. Sorry, had to. Had to. Had to. <laughs> hey there, metal. Let's make you into more metal. Yeah. We need containers. Something awful. Uh, put some landmines away. We've got so many feathers. We're actually going to put... We could stack away. Uh, let's... Let's put the venison stew away for now. Let's put these away. We're not really using them. Put our pistols away. Once again, we have no real use for them. I'm going to put these outside. Because they would be useful. Plunking down a barbed wire. Some dancing. We missed. See, look at that. The pathfinding needs to be changed. Oh! Ah! Oh my god, he's getting so many hits on us. Oh, that's just ridiculous. They need to change... Rug right between the eyes. Oh my god! Really? They're spawning on me now. Remember? We had a problem with this before. We had a problem with this. And I was hoping it was gone. Let's be uh, grown-ups about it. Let's not do that, please. Um, they need to fix the pathfinding. Because zombies should not be able to just walk by your barriers. That's not what a zombie does. Hey, it's Peter Pan! He can fly! Yeah, get out of here, you son of a bitch. Shit. Come here, you. And we died. Fantastic. Well, we died. Um, not entirely sure how that zombie snuck up on me. And I know I was paying attention, trying to shoot the wasp and all that, but... I I don't know. It seemed like he just appeared out of nowhere. Um, whatever, I'll chalk that up to stupidity. I shouldn't have been standing still. Uh, trying to shoot a wasp. And I'm hoping I don't lose anything. Um, that is always the biggest problem. The spawn rate... Despawn rate, sorry, for this game is atrocious. It's been atrocious. Not as bad as it was in Alpha 1, but they need to change it so that your items remain longer. Or maybe kind of like take a, a, a hint from Rust. And I hate that game. I absolutely hate that game. But um, what they did do right was when you die, everything you had on you drops in a little bag. And I kind of think that's what should happen when you die in this game. All your items in your hot bar, just drop into that. Uh, that was another thing I wanted to talk about in the last video, and I didn't really get a chance, or I didn't remember, but they're going to be giving you new um, death and spawn options. So, well, more so, the death options are going to be a huge part of it. You're basically going to get to change some factors when you die, and 
I'm wondering if there'll be a thing that lets you keep all your items when you die. Um, now, again, you know, let's be a little critical about it for a moment here. Um, I'm not saying that's the best thing they should do. The game is about consequence and survival. And losing items in your hotbar is still very punishing in this game. I mean, not as punishing as Minecraft, where you explode in a shower of loot and sadness. Uh, but in this game, you die and you lose everything in your hotbar. Now, although it's not, you know, you're not losing everything here, and I don't like the fact that if you lost everything here, I don't like that at all, because I think the game needs to stand alone from the other t sorts of games. I think it's cool we get to keep everything in here, however unrealistic it is, simply because you are struggling to remember what you have on your hotbar, and you're, you're more pressed to be careful about your prepared items. These are your prepared items, and you're like, well, maybe I don't want to lose this, so you put it away, but because you put it away, you don't have that advantage of having, you know, your sniper rifle or your crossbow or your food. You know, I, I pretty much would have lost most of my water there. I've, I have some water on me, but I would have lost most of it doing that, so... I think that that deserves a place in the game. Oops, we have not loaded this. Being attacked. Um, but I, I, I would still like them to give you the option to keep all your items in your inventory, because after a while of playing it the way you, you know... I, I've literally just done this. I was sick and tired of zombies getting really fast at night or glitching indoors and running around like crazy. So I said, no, enough of that. I'm going to play the game where the zombies move really slow because I, I, I want a change of it. I want a change. I want traditional zombies. And I'm allowed to do that and we're being attacked again because zombies are spawning on us. I don't think they're spawning on us because it's a gas station. That's not the game's... Oh, there's two of them. I don't like the being two. 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 Please, get, get, get away. Get away. Oh, God. Sniper rifle not good for close... Better than crossbow. Better than crossbow. Fuck you. Oh. Oh, God. Oh. Okay, no! Get off me! Oh, my God. Okay, we need to start making uh, spike barricades. It's getting crazy. It's uh, day eight, and um, all hell's breaking loose. Uh, now I regret dropping all that wood. Uh, shit. I'm going to start attacking my fortifications here. They're going to start breaking into everything. If you don't manage your base, you, you start dying. I don't even remember what I was talking about. Uh, I believe I was talking about... The game has to give you options for each and every factor. and This type of game can get away with it. I like the fact that this game has different options. They are breaking into stuff. Hello! Goodbye, zombie dog! Stop breaking my shit, please. Oh my god. I don't even know how he got in. I really don't. Whoa! Whoa! Too much is going on. Too much is going on. And I can't even... <laughs> I can't even... Stay focused. He's breaking my stuff. I can hear him over there. Or was that the fat zombie? I don't remember. We gotta clear that zombie dog out. He's gonna be a, an issue for us. We're gonna have to go lumbering here in a moment. Take out all these trees. What the hell are you doing? I'm not in there! Oh my... God. Oh my god. Oh, they are just ruining everything. They've broken my metal door. So now I don't have, you know, a nice door over there. Ah. Oh, I notice the zombies seem to target everything that you build. They like to ignore pre-existing structures for as long as possible. And they go straight for things. I think they need to fix the pathing. 
uh, before this game is a full release. There, there is. Oh, we're stuck. Oh my God, we're stuck. And there's a zombie staring at me. Oh my god. See, they're not even attacking the wall. They just want to break my shit. Yeah, they definitely need to fix the pathing in this game, because these guys are just too much. Ow. We're gonna die again. We're gonna die. And if my bed wasn't all glitched, you know, I'd die and I'd resurrect in here, but that isn't happening anytime soon. Let me get another Billy Deer over there. Billy Deer. Billy Boy Deer. What are you up to? You got friends. Friends in the distance. Oh, are they resistant to spikes now? What is this? Where'd you come from? Oh my god, we're having way too many zombies to even deal with. It's only day eight. Day 8, and we're having zombie spawn issues. <laughs> I, I don't know if it's it's all, again, I don't think it's all just really just zombie spawn issues. I think it, it comes down to the fact that I was walking around at night and all the zombies were going to spawn in anyways. See, they're, they're going to completely ignore this. I guarantee it. They're just going to walk by it like they normally do. We're going to put it there anyways. We're going to add a lot of spikes here and there. And i got to cut down some trees. Work is never done. They're really not spawning there that much. But we're going to add spikes in the corner. Since they like to creep around corners a lot. They follow the wall to try to find a way in, and then they all just collectively say, hey, let's smash this shit down, and begins. Really, the best way you can build a base in this is underwater with a wall thick with these. Look, they're already spawning in! Now I think it's a zombie spawn issue. That's what it appears to be now area's clear, and then they start attacking for no reason whatsoever. Okay. Uh, I would like to go mining, too, for some more stone, but... God, it's the problem at hand. The situation at hand, not the problem at hand. It's a problem. It doesn't need any embellishing. There you go. Hey, you're dead. Again. Hello. Um... He's going to ignore us, apparently. Or no, he's going to slowly walk to us. See, look, he's ignoring the spikes. I even put... Nope, that time he's got... Yeah, okay. I was going to say, he's going to avoid it, but he didn't have enough time to do that. Um, so we're just going to add spikes here. You need, you need to make a base with a lot of gimmicks that only a player could figure out, such as, you know, traps and jumping puzzles, because otherwise they just find ways around your defenses and... It's a little silly that they can just be like, I'm going to walk by your spikes, and they get by your spikes. They shouldn't be able to do that. They're zombies. This is actually exposed to zombie dogs. I don't like how I did that. That was kind of pointless. Um, you know, while we're here, we're going to reinforce the walls a bit more. Should really reinforce the um, rest of the base here, but... We'll deal with it later. I just want to get this wall more secure, because at the moment it is still very much exposed. We haven't had to deal with spider zombies lately, so hey, that's a bonus, right? I don't even know exactly why that is. It seems like they've overall been reduced in their spawn number. Um, I don't know. It's not regional either, because we have had spider zombies up here, just not many. And boomers? I have not seen a boomer in a while. That's good, that's good, I'm glad. I don't want to see a boomer, I hate them. I mean, I hate spider zombies because they're so freaking try-hard. You know, they run at you and they climb your shit and they get inside places they should not be in. But I don't like boomers because boomers just frankly piss me off. They blow up your stuff and they're supposed to be line of sight. Well, I'm 
I call bullshit on that good sir because I've seen them do it without me ever, you know, showing off that I was there in the first place. Which is not really nice of them. So we're building a wall that's too high. Um, too high as in it two blocks up. Uh, mainly because I can't. I'm just running around the forest doing this menial task of collecting stone for my wall. I said I need to go mining, and I really do need to go mining. Oh, we're out of it. Thank you so much for running out. Um, I do need to go mining, but I really want to get this wall complete now, so I'm sacrificing some time to do this. I, I guess it's not really too much of a sacrifice of time. It's just, uh, we need the resource that is currently available to us outdoors, and as opposed to going down into the mine and painstakingly collecting that, we are choosing to craft quick blocks. Honestly, I'm not getting nearly enough now with one inventory space. So I think I will, after I put these down, I will go back down into the mine and start, uh, We need this wall finished, and I would like to get it finished before the night, but this isn't going to happen. At least, it will offer a temporary reprieve. Most of it. Until they get inside of it, and they start wrecking my shit. Once again. Um, I would use wood, but again, I want it to last a bit longer, so I'm using cobblestone. I'll probably double it up, like I've done here. Door? Do we make a temporary door? No, we cannot. So let's make a temporary door. Wooden door. Wooden door. We have not made a wooden door yet because they are crap. <laughs> that is why. But we will make it since they broke our good door. And probably that's the only reason we haven't made a better door, like this one, which by the way I need to repair at some point. Oh, work, work, so much work. Let's, um, check his body out. Uh, I don't need the fibers. Actually, no, we could use the fibers, because we can always make explosive. I think I should start making TNT. What about you? What do you think? Do you guys think I should make some TNT? I can do it. Gunpowder, gunpowder. Gunpowder. Thank you for the gunpowder. There, we've got gunpowder. Yeah, hold it over the open flame, because that's brilliant. Uh, we've got some of that, which is delectable. Why are those stacked like that? I don't know. Uh, we're going to put some blueberries away, because we're not really making use of that. I'm gonna take these so they don't... Okay, Mr. Hesse! I hear that. We're gonna put these sticks in here. We don't really need five sticks on us. Um, I need paper. Paper, 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 paper. There we got 40 things of paper. TNT, TNT. There. We've got TNT. Gunpowder. How did this go again? I am having trouble remembering. Ah, there we go. TNT. TNT. It is dynamite. Don't need a single piece of stone. I hate having to drop an item on the ground, but, you know, we're going to do it because we can. Um, we're going to put that away. We're going to put the, the gunpowder away. We're going to keep the TNT on us. We are going to put 77 sticks away, because we already got a stack of 200 whatever. And we don't need the bandages. We're going to put those away. I hear zombies breaking stuff. I'd love to know how they're getting in here. Because every now and then, a dog or something just travels in. Hey, there you go. Okay, they're chasing the deer. They're not really after us. Because there's, like, no holes. Uh, 
that's not a hole. I don't know. Okay, we're gonna go down into the underground and blow some. Oh, wrong door. Blow some stuff up. <laughs> 